how to install Windows 7 step 1 we have already downloaded and extracted Windows 7 file step 2 we have to make a bootable device we have to start now step 3 we have to install Windows 7 there are different ways to install Windows 7 using pen drive using micro SD card using DVD using bootable hard disk now we are going to install Windows 7 using bootable hard disk there is already Windows 7 Ultimate. Now we are going to install Windows 7 Home Premium. Now we are going to Computer. Yes, it is Windows 7 Ultimate. And instead of Windows 7 Ultimate, we are going to install Windows 7 Home Premium. Now I am going to show you how to make bootable HDD and install Windows 7 without CD, DVD, USB or memory card. At first go to computer and right click, click manage. Under storage, there is disk management. Please click it. Then, this is system reserve file and this is C drive where we will install Windows 7. Right click on it, then shrink volume. Please wait. It is getting ready. Yes, here is your C drive hard disk and you have to shrink this hard disk drive you have to make other volume where you will keep windows 7 system file and operating system we are keeping 5000 megabyte that means 5 gb shrink yes 4.88 that means 5 gb now make new volume next okay next then its drive will be f click next click next and f is and volume level we can give the volume level name windows information the new drives name windows information ok click next finish please wait the new drive is formatting please wait yes it has been assigned f drive and 4.88 gb that means 5 gb and on the new drive there is f there is d and it may differ now we have to make the partition active right click on it and there is mark partition as active yes now drive F has been active now we have to copy Windows 7 files for this you need not have any ISO file your extracted file should be copied here it is new drive close it please windows information that we have already made this is the windows 7 file please copy it go back and we will paste all Windows 7 extracted file on our new drive F. Paste it. Please show it. The information is being copied on the new drive. Windows 7 all extracted files have been copied here.
now we have to install windows 7 our hard disk drive is already ready for installing we have to restart computer then when windows 7 logo appear then we have to press shift plus f10 to go to command prompt then we have to use dixport comment and other things yes shut down then restart the computer restart Click next. Install now. Shift plus F10 to go to common prompt. From your keyboard, Shift plus F10. Yes, this is common prompt. Here we will comment Dixport. Please write Dixport and enter. list disk here is disk 0 in total disk 25 GB so select disk 0 disk 0 has been selected then list partition see the partition list partition it will show all partitions yes partition 1 partition 2 partition 3 partition on system file reserved system file partition 2 c drive partition 3 new drive list partition no need you need not give this comment you have to select partition one it is our system reserved file go there select partition one then press enter from your keyboard yes one has been selected then we have to make this partition one active please write active and press enter from your keyboard it has been active then we can exit please write exit to close it then close dos comment for closing dos comment please write exit again yes we have come to our previous position and you can install anyone we are going to install windows home premium click next then i accept the license term yes check it and click next custom advanced please click on it this is partition 2 it is our hard disk drive advanced option and we have to delete system reserved file and c partition at first delete it let's delete system reserved file then next one is partition one that means hard disk we have to delete it but we should not delete system information drive D here partition 1 it is hard disk drive C we have to delete it we 
we have deleted system wizard file and partition C. And on unallocated test space, we have to install Windows 7. Click next. Installing Windows 7 has started. It has already copied Windows 7 files. All files are expanding. Please wait. Actually, it takes a lot of time, but I have shown here a little time. Now installing updates. Computer will restart now. Please wait. From the previous position, it will start. Please wait. Computer has restarted again. Please wait. Write your name, please. Click next. You can use password. Select time. Next. You can skip. Restart. Comrade has started, and now we are going to see. Yes, Windows 7 Home Premium we have already installed instead of Windows 7 Ultimate. Okay, our installation has been successful and we have installed Windows 7 Home Premium using our hard disk drive. Now, our extra hard disk drive where we have kept our bootable information and other things we have to delete drive D right click on computer again manage now stories and disk management please wait it's getting ready now we are going to delete our extra drive where we have kept our extra Windows 7 extracted files. We have to delete drive D. We have to delete volume level D. And afterwards we have to extend drive C. At first delete this drive, drive D, delete volume. Click on it. Yes, please wait, it is deleting. Now we have to extend the volume drive C. Click C, then extend volume. It will take the extra volume on drive D. Next, yes, it is extra volume on drive D that we have already deleted. 
yes now it has been 24.9 that means 25 GB okay our job is done we have already installed Windows 7 using bootable hard disk thank you very much if you like channel please give it like and subscribe it